Some farmers buy their seeds from the big guys every year to plant. Me, I save my own. I'm a seed saver. What do you think? What did that set you back? It's an investment. I told you. <laughs> Package for Mr. Percy Schmeisser. Monsanto's claiming the canola you grew in 97 contained a technology in the seeds gene that they created. I never bought their seed. Tests showed substantial contamination. Who are those men, Grandpa? Monsanto will say that everything you grew is their property. You sure got people talking. You stole Monsanto's seed. You know I'm not a thief. Feels like you're angling for a fight. Will Percy have to testify? Definitely. Is that going to be a problem? Getting his driver's license photo is too much limelight for him. Mr. Schmeiser, I'm Rebecca Salco. I'm here to help you with your case. You try to fight them on your own, you will lose. They're tearing our community apart. They go after anyone who speaks out against them. I get sued for doing the same thing my family's been doing for hundreds of years. So you did do it on purpose. You ready for this, Percy? This is a precedent-setting case. There are thousands of people who want to support you. Monsanto says farmers' rights don't matter. We gotta keep fighting! Hey, Percy, can I get your autograph? No. <laughs> A David and Goliath legal battle. In a case where farmers around the world are watching very closely. We've heard your story. You're fighting back. You bring us hope. $1.2 million. That's how much you owe. We're going to lose the farm. If you win, no farmer could ever be sued for saving seeds again. That's Grandpa. We're going to the Supreme Court. Is that something your lawyers have advised? I haven't told them yet. Oh, 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 oh,